equine influenza and equine herpes virus type 1 and 4 are two of the main respiratory viruses that horses can get. They're two separate viruses, but they both cause respiratory diseases. The reason why we want you to vaccinate for that and to prevent those two from getting on your horses is because when a horse loses and gets sick from flu or herpes, they lose time. They lose the ability to do their event. They can't go to the shows. They get high fevers. They don't feel real well. And that can sometimes cause pleural pneumonias or secondary pneumonias. For that reason, it's very important to vaccinate for EHB 1 and 4 and influenza. All horses are considered at risk for influenza. What we find is that the respiratory epithelial cells in their trachea are susceptible to flu replicating in them. All humans can get their flu. All horses get their own flu. They don't cross over. But as you travel around, just like you would travel around in an airport or something and the horses go to show, they're at risk of getting a respiratory disease. In this case, when they get influenza, they can be down and out of work for up to three weeks because the replication and the virus can cause such damage in their upper respiratory tree that they cause mucopurulent discharge and they cough a lot. That coughing helps spread the disease too. So it's really important to get your horses vaccinated for equine influenza to help prevent them from getting equine influenza. Herpes and influenza do tend to have a secondary wave that can affect your horses. And that's why we recommend that you booster all horses and or if you haven't given their primary shot, make sure they're vaccinated in the fall. You wanna make sure that your horses have good vaccination for equine herpes one and four and equine influenza in the fall. People tend to forget that horses that travel around a lot that can go to sales or shows, they come back from those sales and shows. So when they come back, they make the whole farm be at risk as well. So you'll ask somebody, has this horse left the farm? And the answer at times is no. Have you had other horses that left the farm that came back that got these horses sick? And the answer is typically yes. For that reason, I consider all of those horses at risk for equine influenza and equine herpes virus. I recommend Fluvac Innovator EHV41 vaccination booster for all my horses in the fall.